Hello everyone, I have a very special guest from all the way from Nepal, a very uh, bright player, uh, Rupesh. So Rupesh, how are you? I'm fine, how about you? I'm good. So Rupesh, you have come to play the first Bikaner Open. Uh, mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about yourself. Okay, it's me Rupesh Deshwal. Uh, I'm FIDE Master, right now rating 2135. So I'm from Nepal. So it's been a long journey playing chess. Uh, I think after six years I have been uh, here in India. I played Chhattisgarh mm -hmm. also. So okay. yeah, right now playing in Bikaner. Okay, so you have come six years later in India. Uh, yeah. Okay, what what took you so long? There are so many, there have been so many tournaments. Uh, actually, I went to Russia for the my abroad studies, so <laughs> I could not be here. Oh, okay. So what are you studying, or what did you study? Uh, I studied bachelor in physical education. I got a scholarship uh, from the chess through only. Oh, okay, mm. okay. Uh, so have you completed it? Hi, I have completed bachelor degree. So you, uh, so did you s stop chess and then complete it, or you were also playing chess uh, actually, tournament? Actually, kind of playing a little bit, but mm. uh, totally focused on study only that time. Okay, so when you went, I uh, just asking about Russia. When you went to Russia, did you see the chess culture there, or you were just into college and focusing on studies? Yeah, there was a chess culture. I did play some Moscow Open and few tournaments. Mm -hmm. Not what I expected, but yeah, it was overall good experience. Great. So when did you start playing chess? Uh, I think when I was in class three. Okay, it's uh, actually I started officially on my birthday only. My brother used to play, like uh, elder brother. He was one of the good player uh, at his time. So my coach was Mohinder Dakal. He is from Sikkim now and general secretary of AICF, I believe. Mm -hmm. So yeah, he was my first coach, and from there I started to play chess. How did you coach under him? Uh, actually, he was in Nepal back before, like oh, okay. almost like uh, 17, 18 years. Mm -hmm. So he used to coach us, like uh, we had a tuition with him, like a math and science. Mm -hmm. So in a laser uh, time, he used to teach like half an hour after the tuition. So I was uh, too much interested in chess. Okay. And I used to play a lot. So yeah, from that I got to know uh, chess, about chess and I started to play chess. That's great. And uh, you started in, since standard three. Yeah. So that's a long time. So which are the major tournaments that you have played? Uh, I have played World Youth back in 2007. Uh, and Olympiad, I have uh, thrice like participated in that is Turkey, Georgia, and right now in the Chennai also. And I have won like uh, won Blitz and the Rapid, uh, Bronze and the Silver Medal in 2015. I think it was in Singapore, an Asian tournament, some age group and all. So, oh, uh, what that's all. <laughs> that's great. So, so tell us a little bit about the chess scene in Nepal. How like how excited are youngsters uh, playing chess, and how strong are they becoming? Actually, I don't see the growth uh, because when I was a kid, I can see it was like 2100 plus rating, still the same thing, like 2100 plus. Mm -hmm. I'm trying my best to like do whatever I can do. So yeah, there is a chess culture, but not exactly what uh, we want. Like uh, there is like a younger generation coming on, uh, but there is less exposure. Opportunity is less. I think uh, something should be done from Nepal Chess Association and all. Okay, so do you think that is the reason why not many players are coming up from Nepal? Uh, uh, there is, there's, uh, like from India when there is Biswanath Anand, the icon, mm -hmm. so many players came mm -hmm. and now like there is like so many grandmasters and all, but in Nepal I think the icon lacks, so right. yeah, I think someone should be icon and maybe from that we will get an expo. I think Anish Giri can be a good icon for you uh, guys. It is, but still <laughs> he is in Netherlands. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but Anish Giri is uh, like uh, an idol for everyone ah, who yeah. plays chess. That's yeah. for sure. So, I mean, when you were growing up, who were, who did you idealize uh, in the world of chess? Vishwanath uh, Anand. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, okay. And currently, uh, do you follow anyone's game very uh, closely? I love Anish Giri. Actually, I have been following his like courses and all. So, oh, okay. Yeah. His chessable courses? Yeah. Okay. Like a night of. <laughs> night of. <laughs> Okay, I think Anish will be very happy to know that uh, someone from Nepal is following him so closely and learning something. So, uh, tell us about this tournament. Uh, you have come to Rajasthan the first time? Yeah, this is my first time. Uh, it's been nice, like accommodation and the organizing have is great. Though my tournament is not going great. <laughs> so, yeah, like uh, organizers are very helpful. Like I had mm -hmm. some few issues on the beginning day, but they solved like quickly and all. I'm happy with them. Okay, and uh, w what issues do you think you are facing here? I mean, in the tournament, what is going wrong? Uh, I don't think like a little bit of like it's okay. Okay, but you are you have I think you have returned to chess after a long time. I think ah, it will yeah. take some tournaments for you to get yeah, back. Yes. 
right Austria. right okay rupesh it was great talking to you and uh, i hope that this tournament gives you a stepping stone to do uh, better in the next tournaments thank you so much okay all the best thank you so much